Hey hello and welcome to IOP presents 9 movie characters whom we did not know existed in real life. Just as filmmakers create memorable characters they also sometimes seek inspiration from real life characters. We are thankful to the various web sources who have helped us. Harris Glenn Milstead Even if you have never seen the 1989 Disney movie The Little Mermaid you have probably seen the evil Ursula somewhere on the internet as GIF or something like that Disney's Moana directors John Muska and Ron Clements have revealed that everyone's favorite sea witch is actually based on a very iconic drag queen divine or better known as Harris Glenn Milstead In Disney's version of The Little Mermaid, the animation of Ursula, the sea witch was inspired by Divine. Michelle Phelps. She inspired the film 51st Dates where her character was played by Drew Barrymore. In 1985, an English woman by the name of Michelle Phelps suffered a motorcycle accident. The same year she met her future husband Ian. 5 years later she was involved in another serious accident along with her husband. She was diagnosed with a rare form of enteroid amnesia. In 1994 Michelle had epilepsy as a result of her head injuries. Since then she has struggled to form any new memories. Every morning for the last 22 years her husband whom she only remembers as her boyfriend shows her their wedding album and answers any questions Michelle may have leave post-it stickers on the refrigerator and all sorts of tips that can help her that's what is shown in the famous movie called 51st dates Mehran Karimi Naseri Mehran Karimi Naseri also known as Sir Alfred Mehran is an Iranian refugee who has been living in the departure lounge of Terminal 1 in Charles de Gaulle Airport since August 8, 1988. In the 2004 film The Terminal, a man is trapped at New York's JFK Airport when he is denied entry into the United States. Victor Novoski, played by Tom Hanks, cannot return to his home country either as a military cop took place while he was in mid flight his country was no longer recognized so his passport became void too both the stories are the same or almost the same hiram bingham the second indiana jones is said to be inspired from him to be clear there is no tangible or irrefutable evidence that indiana jones is based on him but there are similarities abound from their occupations to their hats george lucas created the character as a tribute to several action heroes with whom he grew up sergio gutierrez benitez he is the inspiration behind ignacio or nacho in nacho libre sergio gutierrez benitez was a catholic priest in charge of an orphanage in a degraded neighborhood of Veracruz, Mexico. In 1973, he founded the orphanage La Casa Hogar de los Corojo de Fred Tormenta, home to 270 children. In need of money to take care of them, he got into wrestling with this nickname, Fred Tormenta. Frank Sinatra Yes, he is the Godfather. In real life, the role of Johnny Fontaine was played by none other than Frank Sinatra. Although never confirmed, it is believed that Sinatra was closely linked to the underworld or the mafia, just like the film. Professor Nettleship. Believe it or not, the character of Severus Snape, played by Alan Rickman, was based on a chemistry professor who had 
G.K. Rowling as one of his pupils. Professor Nettleship, who died at age 71 after a battle with cancer, discovered his link to Professor Snape when he was portrayed by Alan Rickman in the movie franchise. Roy Lee Rocky Dennis Roy Lee Rocky Dennis for the mask. He was an American boy afflicted with cricopharyngeal dyspraxia, a rare and sclerotic bone disorder. The condition usually results in neurological disorders and death during childhood. The mask was based on his life. The Zoro This character is based on a Californian legend. Macaulay is believed to have received the inspiration for this fictional character Don Diego de la Vega from a book titled The Life and Adventures of Jacqueen Murrieta, a real-life person who lived during the California Gold Rush. He turned from an honest miner to an illegal thug. So that was all for today. See you next time. Till then, bye-bye.